You may have seen this incredible picture behind us of the moon in your news feed this week. It's so cool. It was taken by a pair of space enthusiasts and it took nine months of painstaking work to render it. Yeah, Paul Murphy sat down with one of the astrophotographers who happens to live on the North Shore. Yeah. The moon like we've never seen it before. The craters, the colors, the textures, all in spectacular detail. In general, with all of my space photos, what I love the most is just getting people excited about space because I am just head over heels for it. LSU and Fountain Blue High School graduate Connor Mathern is one of two astrophotographers who produced the 174 megapixel image. Mathern set up a telescope and camera in his Mandeville backyard last November to shoot the moon. His partner, Andrew McCarthy, captured pictures of the lunar surface from his home in Arizona the same night. It took them nine months to painstakingly stitch together a combined 250,000 photos to come up with this amazing image. There are very, very subtle color variations in the moon. Uh, a lot of the different uh, mineralogies of the moon end up showing as orange. In this case, it would be iron oxide and blue is titanium. So you have areas that are more rich in iron oxide, areas that are more rich in titanium of the moon. By comparison, Here's one of my pictures of the moon. Seeing that the moon isn't just a black and white uh, blob out there floating around is cool, uh, but also I like to see the variations in the crater personally. It is a nebula that exists within the Orion constellation. So Mathern admits here. the moon is a little out of his kind of comfort like zone. He considers himself more of a deep space photographer, capturing images of faraway nebulas and galaxies. Just try it, like go out with your camera and just, you know, prop it up on a rock even and take some long exposures. They've come back with great pictures of even the Milky Way. Mathern first posted the moonshot on Saturday. It's now become an out of this world sensation with more than 300 million views on social media. In Mandeville, Paul Murphy, Eyewitness News. Very, very cool. Well, Mathern and his partner called their photo a collaborative tribute to NASA's Artemis mission. The New Orleans made rocket is now set to blast off for the first time on Monday. It will be an unmanned test of the space launch system designed to return astronauts, including the first woman, back to the moon.